Hello guys, welcome to the Quarantine Home Cook. Hello guys, what's up? So, it's been a while since we made a cooking vlog. Medyo na busy lang. We are here today in Boracay and it's raining. So I figured, why not make a soup today? For this vlog, we're going to make a squash soup. Let's go! So let's start making our squash soup. Ano bang mga kailangan natin? Of course, it's a squash soup, so we need a squash. This is 332 grams, mga 17 pe to 18 pesos. I'm using soy milk for my um, squash soup. We probably need about like one and a half glass of soy milk. Kung gusto nyo malapot, pwede natin bawasan yung milk. Kung gusto nyo malabnaw, pwede natin dagdagan yung milk. It depends on you. We need nor, crab, and corn soup. Siguro kalahati lang nito yung kailangan natin. Of course, salt and pepper. One onion. Garlic. Pepper. Oil. And optional, this is cashew nuts. And coconut cream. Talaga lang natin siya sa top ng soup natin. So it's optional. It's up to you guys. Let's go. So the first thing that we have to do is to peel our squash. Ah. Siguro gamit ako na lang ng knife to. Hindi umuubra yung peel. Next, let's peel our onion. So let's just use half of it. Then we need garlic. Probably like half of this. This is like one, two, three, four, six cloves. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cloves. You don't need to chop it because e so sa tay lang naman natin to sa so, oil hanggang lumambot yung squash. All right, that's it. Let's clean up a bit. All right, so we have our onions here. Garlic, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now we are going. is it. So, we have our squash. We have our garlic and onion. We're going to saute this. Let's go. So, nandito na tayo sa ating kalan. There you go. So, first thing na gagawin natin is to toast natin tong cashew nuts natin. This is 30 grams cashew nuts. I'm just gonna put it there. To toast lang natin siya. Medyo mabango na siya guys. Medyo natutose na siya. Hindi natin siya kailangan sunugin guys. Medyo i-roast lang natin. Para lumabas yung flavor. We just the fire to medium. There you go. Medyo natutose siya ng konti doon. Next. We need to add oil. This is olive oil, but you can also use yung normal lang na cooking oil. Maarte lang ako, guys. Alright, so to that, I'm going to add the onion and garlic. And the squash. For that, I'm going to add salt and then pepper. I'm 
and a little bit of nutmeg. Mga 1 4 teaspoon. There. I'm in medium fire. Aluhaluin nyo lang occasionally. Susukin nyo na tinador para malaman nyo kung mashi na. This one is not yet ready. Medyo hard pa siya. na tinidor, malapit na siya. Uh, pero konti pa. So, ito na yung ating sinatay na squash, onion, and garlic. As you can see, hindi siya sunog. Uh, Nag-caramelize ang konti yung squash if you're going to taste it at this stage. It's a bit sweet. Yung onion din caramelize a bit and yung garlic. So, hindi dapat siya sunog kasi yung, again, yung garlic and yung onion, it's bitter kapag nasunog. So, let's yung mamash natin to sa blender. Okay? Let's go! So, ito yung ating blender. Alagay lang natin yung ating sinote na squash, onion, and garlic. And then, to that, we are going to add one glass of soy milk. One glass of soy milk. And then, we will pulse it. Alright, done with this. Now let's go ahead and put it back to the fire. Kailan natin siyang initan, gagawin na natin yung ating soup. Alright, so ito na yung dito natin doluto yung ating soup. Let's pour our squash soup. Then, this one is set natin siya sa medium na flame. Habang ginagawa yan, we're going to dilute half of this crab meat and sweet corn soup na nor. We're going to dilute half of this sa half glass, half glass ng soya milk. Okay, let's go. So, I'm going to add half of this. This is um, 60 grams or 30 grams. Half ng soya milk. Okay. So, let's lang natin. Hanggang matuna ko siya. So let's go back to our squash soup. So yung ating squash chips, et squash soup, eto siya, tinakpang ko lang. Imimix natin, make sure na nasa medium kayo para hindi siya mag-scorch. Now, since nag-boil na siya, we're going to add our crab meat and soup mixture. And then hintayin lang natin siya mag-boil. Once nag-boil, it's done. Mabilis lang maluto guys. From here, mabilis lang maluto. And magtitikin siya na magtitikin. So be careful. Okay. Hintayin lang natin siya mag-boil. And once nag-boil na siya, it's done. Takpa ko siya para hindi mag-evap. Medyo haluin niyo siya occasionally para hindi siya mag-scorch. We don't like that. Alright, so eto na. Luto na yung ating soup. I'm going to serve this now. Okay. Ito yung consistency na hinahanap natin. 
All right, so now let's go ahead and serve this. I nalagay ko lang siya dito. All right. This would probably make two to three servings. And then to that, we are going to add cocoa cream, coconut cream. Mga one tablespoon. And then finish it with toasted cashew nuts. All right, so there you have it, our squash soup. So let's try now our um, squash soup. Tingnan na natin yung ating squash soup. This is the moment we've been waiting for. So. Mm. It's very Pinoy. Pinoy version ng squash soup. It's crunchy. Tama lang yung thickness niya. Now, if you want it na medyo malabnao, you can add in a bit of soya milk. More soya milk. Um, you can add in herbs. More herbs to it. If you want, uh, you can add in a bit of a cinnamon in there. Yeah, paired with garlic bread. Perfect. Guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. It's um, at the Quarantine Home Cook and on Facebook, it's um, the Quarantine Home Cook. Of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. I hope you enjoyed making squash soup with me today. Until next time, see you guys. Adios!